I'll just join in a time of prayer. The prayer that I'm offering today was written by Reverend Tracy Potter, Minister for Youth and Young Adult Engagement for the United Church of Christ. Let us pray. God of our weary years and God of our silent tears, Thou who has brought us thus far on the way, we invite your presence into our midst as we pay tribute to all who have labored for justice, equality, and love. We pray that in this moment you would strengthen us to continue to fight for the fulfillment of the dream that the Reverend Martin Luther King Jr. so eloquently laid out on the steps of the Lincoln Memorial. Help us to labor so that every valley is exalted every hill and mountain made low, the rough places are plain, and the crooked places made straight, so that the glory of the Lord is revealed and all flesh see it together. Let your love guide us to see one another as fully human with diverse hues, colors, ethnicities, and cultures, and respect the content of their character. And let your spirit strengthen us for the fight of today and tomorrow until all God's children can say with full conviction, free at last, free at last. Thank God Almighty, I'm free at last. Amen.